KTF Productions is a Christ-focused video production company with a twofold purpose, to glorify Christ and to lead others to Him. We do this by producing video, audio, print, and multimedia projects as a means to reach as many as God wills with the gospel. KTF isn't and never has been a large production company with employees and deep pockets to drive the bottom line. Actually, it's not much more than a weekend hobby run by a married couple and created with a group of on-call volunteers, all with a heart for the Great Commission. Like most ministries, it started with a seed that God planted, watered, and eventually used for kingdom purposes. I graduated from Marcellus High School in 1989 and jumped right into college, not really knowing what I wanted to do for a living. After a couple of years at Western Michigan University, I decided that I wanted to act. There was a student organization on campus called WSTV, which stands for Western Student Television. I joined thinking that I'd be able to act in someone else's production, but there were already cliques formed in the organization, and they pretty much only created videos within their own little cliques. So I thought that I'd either have to find my way into one of those cliques, or I'd have to direct and produce my own video and act in that. So I chose to produce my own videos. And in doing so, I found that actually making these videos was more fun and rewarding than acting in them. So during my time there, I wrote, directed, and edited several productions, most of which were nothing more than really bad movie parodies. It's reading right, Mom. Then you're not reading it right. No, look, that's what it says. Five meters. Four meters. Three meters. It was also about that time that I started attending a ministry on campus called Christians in Action. With a dynamic name like that, I had to check it out. So I went, and it was there that God really got a hold of my life. I saw sold-out Christians who were on fire for Christ. I started attending Bible studies there, and I began to really take my faith seriously. It wasn't before long that I decided to use my talents, such as they were, for Christ. So I got this crazy idea to make a Christian movie. I was already making scenes and dramatic shorts for WSTV, so I figured that making a movie was only really a collection of these scenes and it couldn't be that hard. So not quite knowing what I was getting into, I wrote a script, I recruited college friends and work friends to be my actors, and then I began to shoot this movie. I called it Keep the Faith, and it was as B as any B movie could be. Very low production quality, one dimensional script, and acting performances from some who have never acted before or since. But we screened this very long two and a half hour movie at one of the lecture halls on campus and when we did, we had an incredible response. I had a guy come up to me, he was crying as he hugged me, telling me that this movie was God telling him to come back to the faith. Now I realized two things at that moment. First, it wasn't me or even this movie that caused this kind of effect in this man. It was the Holy Spirit who used what we made for the cause of Christ to bring about a godly result. And secondly, I knew I was hooked. I was still too young and naive to know how difficult it actually is to make movies, but God used what we had, a simple VHS camcorder, a plastic tripod, and a passion to reach out through video. I met my wife, who I was actually dating at the time, and I asked her if she wanted to help me out with this movie, and she said sure. And once we finished it, we decided that we'd start a video ministry, and we named it after this movie. So KTF Productions actually stands for Keep the Faith Productions. Since that first movie, we've always had some kind of project in the work that either glorifies Christ or is designed to lead unbelievers to Him. Just my wife and I run the ministry. I do most of the creative work and she does all of the legal and financial stuff. We solicit volunteers as we need them. No one gets paid to work on or be in a KTF production. It is all volunteer. One reason we only use volunteers is because none of the videos that we create are designed to make any money. And with no money coming in, we can't really afford to pay anyone. We make every project with the sole purpose of glorifying Christ or bringing others to Him. And we believe that anyone who watches anything that we make shouldn't have to pay to do so. Another reason is that i found that money has a way of muddying people's motivations. I'd rather have someone who is dedicated for the right reasons than a movie superstar diva who isn't. Plus, money can tempt us to compromise. As it stands, we can make whatever we believe God is calling us to make any way we choose to make it. We don't have anyone standing over us, making sure that everything is politically correct or deciding that something is too preachy and that no one's going to want to watch it. We have the freedom to not please man. And in every step of the way, God has always provided what we've needed when we've needed it. Whether it is actors, money, writers, equipment, knowledge, contacts, or even some outlets to show our work. 
And unless God takes us in a different direction, I suspect that it'll always be that way. Since 1993, God has continued to use KTF Productions as a tool to reach out with the gospel. And as a result, he has and continues to do amazing things in the hearts of those it reaches, some of which he allows us to see and so much more that we'll never know about until we enter heaven. But every step of the way, we pray that we will never lose focus on our core mission, to create projects that glorify Christ or lead others to him. That is why we do our best to make sure that KTF Productions is a truly Christ-focused video production company.